Hi, I am Anna. I come from www.ntvforex.com. Europea S car sector back on the road again. Analysis HTTP ntvforex.com news ID CE 514991102056131613 AM. The European car sector remains in the midst of far reaching upheaval and its ability to revamp its business model from combustion engines to electrically chargeable vehicles will set the tone for future growth prospects. In the long run, the green transition and ongoing changes to global value chains could lead to the car industry losing some of its economic importance for Europe. However, leaner, automated production lines and reduced overcapacity do not necessarily have to be negative developments, as these could end up boosting European productivity in the long term. A perfect storm even before the coronavirus, Europe's car sector was in the doldrums. After a multi-year phase of strong demand from 2011-17, car sales first hit a roadblock in 2018 when a switch to new emission test procedures WLTP triggered a collapse in car production by over 20%. Although sales recovered somewhat after bottlenecks abetted, they never matched previous levels, as they were weighed down by a combination of intensifying global trade tensions, driving bans on diesel cars in a growing number of German cities stricter EU car emission standards and shifting consumer preferences towards electric and hybrid cars, where European producers have long remained dormant and are only now starting to catch up with US and Asian producers such Tesla and Toyota. Europe's industry model has long been heavily reliant on the car sector A and has become even more so following the global financial crisis GFC 13.8M Europeans work in the auto industry directly and indirectly accounting for 6.1% of total employment and some 12% of gross value added GVA in manufacturing stems from the sector. Among Euro-area countries, Germany is by far the most exposed to the car industry, with nearly a quarter of GVA in manufacturing accounted for by motor vehicles. Entering the COVID-19 crisis already in a fragile state, the car sector has experienced one of the biggest declines in activity. Euro-area passenger car registrations tumbled by a substantial 78.5% YY in April and were still down 28.6% YY in June. With factories closed under lockdowns, the European Automobile Manufacturers Association ACEA estimates that EU-wide production losses amount to at least 2.4 M units so far. As consumers have become increasingly reluctant to make big-ticket purchases amid deteriorating employment prospects, a big turnaround in demand seems unlikely, even after dealerships have reopened. Download the full Euro Area Research. Subscribe our channel to receive the news as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. If you want to read real-time news, text messages to MT5 Expert Advisors page at https://mt5.expert.advisors.